states are coming from the island, and they're mainly people who say they've been staying home. News 12's Kevin Vesey shows us what you can do to prevent yourself from getting the virus. The numbers have left many New Yorkers, including Governor Cuomo, scratching their heads. 84% of new coronavirus hospital patients in a recent survey said they've been working from home or not working at all, which has some wondering how they caught the virus. Dr. Sharon Nachman with Stony Brook Medicine says that just because someone is working from home, it doesn't mean they're in the house all the time. There is that possibility that we're not social distancing adequately enough. Many Long Islanders, even those who spend most of their time inside, still have to leave the house for essentials. Others go out for exercise. All fine, according to the doctor, as long as you keep yourself and everyone around you safe. For instance, at the supermarket, you should definitely wear a mask and definitely wear gloves. Follow the rules in the store, go one way, and try to avoid staying close to someone else who's shopping. Dr. Nachman says you can also wash or wipe down the items you've purchased once you get home. And when it comes to picking up the mail or packages, you can leave the mail outside because the temperature won't allow virus to continue to grow and bring it in a couple of hours later. And while you're out, the doctor says you should be aware of any items that you come into contact with, including one that a lot of us are constantly touching. Your phone is unfortunately extension of your hands. Keeping your phone clean is nice. But even though hundreds of New Yorkers are still being hospitalized with COVID-19, the numbers are trending in the right direction. And officials say that's because most people are doing their best to stay safe. Even with that flaws in the system, so to speak, our numbers are still coming down. Kevin BC News 12, Long Island. Once you get home, doctors say the most important thing to do is wash your hands right away and then disinfect the doorknob. Well, with dental.